Hello, this is Dr. Claudia Kotka from the Washington Institute for Dentistry and Laser Surgery. One of the things that sometimes we are faced to do is of course the retreatment of old crowns. And so what depicts the equivalence of an old crown? Sometimes um, the crowns are made of 100% ceramic or variations of very different ceramics. And um, in other videos, we, we go into that particular detail. Sometimes crowns are made of a base of metal and on top of that a certain ceramic is built up and of course sometimes crowns are made all metal um, we certainly don't see the all metal options anymore with the advancement of biotechnology and material science however we certainly see sometimes of the old crowns what is concerning in terms of the age of a crown is the type of metal that is either underneath the ceramic or actually makes up the entire crown. Sometimes, and we know that with age, metal changes. It changes through a corrosive process, depending on what type of metal was used, what the combination of the alloys were, and so we can expect certain amount of breakdown. If the crowns reaches the gum line in any way, shape or form, or are underneath gum lines, or wherever they are positioned near, or they're in contact with the gum line, certainly that can contribute to an irritation of the gum, if you will, and that can predispose to a persistent inflammation or swelling of the gum, which is not ideal in terms of longevity, not just from a pain perspective and swelling, of course, and bacterial aggregates, or even a secondary decay, but also from a perspective of just bone and signaling response. In that scenario, certainly we have to consider removing the crowns and there are multiple different ways we, we can do that. So please don't hesitate to contact us with questions on what we've just been discussing as well as, um, of course, seeing our app at, at DC Laser Dentist, and we can easily be reached at www.dclaserdentist.com.